Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make medu vada, also known as the urad dal vada. I'm going to show you a technique of how to make vadas without deep frying them, and that technique is by using this pan. It's called the curry paniyaram pan. So now let's dive right in and learn how to cook this delicious non-fried vada. Below are the ingredients needed to make the medu vada. I have here with me a cup of whole urad dal that has been soaking for about 3 hours. Using a strainer, strain out all the excess water from the urad dal. We need to use very little water to grind the urad dal so that you can shape them well if you're going to be deep frying. Next, we will grind the urad dal using a blender into a smooth and thick batter. Make sure you grind using very little water. Once ground into a smooth and thick batter, transfer into a container. To add in some flavors to the batter, we will now coarsely pound some black pepper and add it to the batter. Next, we will add some salt to taste. Stir the batter well to combine the salt and pepper into it. You can now add in the optional ingredients into the batter to make it even more delicious. Next, we will preheat a curry paniyaram pan and add in a little oil into each cavity. Once the oil is heated, we will scoop in the dal batter into each of the cavities. Cover the pan and allow it to steam until you notice the top looks cooked. After a couple of minutes of steaming, notice the top part of the vada looks cooked. At this point, you could add a little more oil and then flip the vada so it can get cooked and crisp from both sides. This time, allow it to cook without the cover. When the vadas are crisp and brown, Transfer the vadas to a platter and continue the same process with the remaining batter. To serve the vadas, place the vadas in a bowl or a platter. Pour in some vegetable sambar and sprinkle some chopped onions. This makes a delicious breakfast along with idlis. <laughs> 